good everybody my name is Jay Fatty welcome back to another video today we're going to talk about automating the stretch pro mode that was added in FL Studio 20.9 okay this adds so much sauce for sampling because you get this format slider it doesn't change the key of the sample just the octave of it or whatever you're using it on today we're using it for a sample so let me show you what I'm talking about we're going to automate this into the playlist for this sample here we're going to put in an empty pattern that's the length of the sample, all right? And then we're also going to go and right-click on bar 25 and bring it all the way back to bar 1 up here on this black bar to highlight that whole area. Now we'll go back into the sample, and we're going to route this slider to a slider on my MIDI keyboard so I can do it with just using that. But you can also automate it with using the mouse right here. So what we're going to do is right-click and do link to controller and I'm just going to tweak one of the sliders on the controller all right cool now I have it mapped out I'm gonna just go to the record button and do notes and automation now let's hit play and let's mess with it a little bit So as you can see there, you can get a nice groove using that. It is such a dope sauce that they added that inside FL Studio 20.9. So yeah, as you can see, that adds so much sauce. So don't sleep on the Stretch Pro and how easily you can automate it inside FL Studio to really get that sauce. If this video brought you value, please leave a like, hit subscribe, and hit that little bell. Make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, y'all. Peace.